Okay, this is import for prosperity, import for me. Anyway, I removed the flywheel. When I bought it, the carburetor was already off. This is a 1994 70 horsepower force. Not my first choice in an outboard engine, but anyway, it's got low compression on number two. I also looked at it with a bore scope, number one, or something going on with a piston. So anyway, I'm taking the power head off. I took the engine off the boat and brought it up here. So I made a little stand on the side of my workbench, counterweighted it with a bunch of weight so it won't tilt over and hit my car. So anyway, next scene here in a minute. I'm going to slow down for a second so we can see where the wires go. This goes to the starter solenoid. These are the tilt and trim wires. This is the enrichner, like a choke starter motor. On this side, because I'm taking the stator off, I've got the flywheel off, marked it to the top so I know which way it goes back. And with the wires go back into here, power pack, regulator rectifier, ignition coils. This is the fuel pump here, it's not coming off, but I'll be taking all this wire and this bracket and the stator off all at once. So, anyway, you'll see the way the wire's routed. Okay. And I'm also going to be taking this nut here off that goes to the, this is the adjust timing right here and it's part of this linkage. We'll get into that later when I fix it. 